uh, different when you're on a collab channel, which I've learned, but, eh, oh well. Uh, I just wanted to show you guys something here. Well, before even looking at who this person really is or looking at the autograph that she put on there, does this person look familiar to you at all? Nora Greenwald? Does that look familiar at all to anybody? <laughs> well, if it doesn't, well then, how about here? Does it look familiar? Do you know? I don't know how good the quality is, you know, if you can see it really well or not, but... Well, anyway, she is known as, well, her, her real name is Nora Greenwald, but her wrestling name is Molly Holly. And why do I bring this up all of a sudden? Why do I just randomly just point this out your way? Because she actually lives here about 15 miles away from T. Fibber here. Or she's actually from. She doesn't really live here. She just She's from uh, a, a town called Plummer, Minnesota, which is just 15 miles, uh, you know, pretty much 15 miles from T. Fibber. And I got to meet her here a couple of years ago when I was doing radio a couple summers ago. And she sent me this DVD which she autographed. She autographed said, To Sean from Molly. And then on the inside, oops, in the inside it said, To Sean from Nora. And I thought that was pretty cool. I just wanted to show you guys that uh, this DVD is actually a pretty, pretty good. It's a documentary, because I knew she had a documentary out on her. It's a, like a wrestling shoot video, but it's her talking about her life in professional wrestling and before professor wrestling and then afterwards she's a big believer in religion she's very religious and i guess she's been that way pretty much since she was 14 years old but she's really even more of it now than she ever was before and uh that's what's different from her being a wrestler if you remember her you know in wwe getting her head shaved at wrestlemania 20 and you know being part like of, of uh, one of the original bodyguards for macho man randy savage back in the days of wcw Though that she was here, this was her. Uh, we got to meet here a couple of years ago, and we got to hang out. Too bad I didn't have a camera then, because it seems like every time I've had a chance to hang out with a celebrity or whatnot, it has not never been on camera. You know, when I hung out with Greg and Hammer Valentine, I uh, did my first ever radio interview with him that you can find here on the on my YouTube channel, the audio version, not the video version, because there was no video, it's just audio. But uh, when we did that, you know, that would have been perfect. You guys would have really loved to see that, I'm sure. As proof, I'm sure, to the non-believers out there. But, yes, I have uh, en endured some celebrity-isms here uh, in my lifetime, in the last, especially the last couple of years. I've met Ned Beatty, and he's the guy who was in Superman 1 and 2. He played John Connors, or uh, John Connors, I think a Terminator. He played Dan Connors' father in Roseanne. He uh, was in Deliverance. Yes, he was the one that had a squeal like a pig. Uh, he actually stays in Carlson, Minnesota here, which is 40 miles from T. February, 20 miles from Greenbush. Uh, he actually stays here during the summertime. Uh, my question is to you guys is, uh, do you guys have any celebrities that, are, uh, that you met that are real close by or whatnot? I'm sure you have some stories to tell, if you have. And if you haven't, and if you want to, you better go out and get some. Go out and get 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 it or whatever. Find some. Uh, but my question is, have you guys ever met any big celebrities, big name celebrities? And you know, share share your stories. Let tell me your stories. I want to hear, you know, what was experience. I know Brendan has met many celebrities, so I already know that. But I'm talking all the other guys, the ones who haven't, you know, or the ones who who uh, who have but don't really talk about it. Now is your chance to express it yourself and to let us all know, let the whole internet world know, uh, you know, what, uh, how it, your, that experience was for you. And I, yes, I know, they're regular people. I've been told that many, many times. I know that. But they're people that have done something cool with their life, you know. Uh, they're, they're people that have done something with their lives that uh, are where I'd like to see myself being at. They've acted. They, they're not just farmers or doctors or working in the stock markets or whatever. They actually get to do something that gets a, they get to see the world anyway with their acting jobs and all that so eh. so anyway that's all I have to say in today's video thanks again to all the people who've uh, been watching all that 
More great videos to come, obviously, since we're doing the daily summer vlogs. I still got another 60 videos to make. God damn it. <laughs> but anyway, we'll look forward to it. Let's hear. Those, let's see those comments, and uh, yeah, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye bye.